This is Work BC. Real people. Inspiring stories. Hi, I'm Danny. I've held a lot of jobs in my life. I've been in service, in retail, even been an amateur poker player. Now that I'm a filmmaker, I thought I'd turn the lens on people who have made their own career changes to discover just how they found their fit. So what kind of people seek out the program? A lot has changed in 10 years. I didn't know how to go about doing anything anymore. And the key thing that employers are saying they look for the most is attitude. I want you to practice this. So when you're out in the world and you're looking for jobs, you can very effectively describe to that employer why he should hire you. And that was my big thing, was I didn't want to settle with just any job. I wanted a career back again. People change careers for any number of reasons. Learning a new skill set can be challenging, but there are resources in place to help with the transition. I wanted to learn more, so I thought I'd talk with someone who successfully changed careers in order to figure out how she did it for herself. I am Carol Baston, and I am the director here at Mount Mineral Spa. I absolutely love talking to people, working with people, being around people. What was life like before? Uh, life before was pretty chaotic and crazy. I did a lot of waitressing and managing at different night jobs and part-time jobs, and before that I was a flight attendant. What made you decide to change? So I've got two kids, and my oldest one is autistic, and my husband and I worked our schedule around the kids' lifestyle. I was a flight attendant, and it was obviously a career I could not go back to. I didn't know what I wanted to do with my life. I had no idea. So I was taking a course at the college, and I went into the job fair. They had a booth set up. It was a government-funded course on career development for people like myself who were getting back into the workforce. And it really helped me finding the career that I wanted. There's different types of people out there, different personalities, and the course helped me with that, with what you like and what you don't like, what your strong features are and what your weaknesses are, and it helped me realize what kind of a career, what kind of a life would fit into my lifestyle. It was like that was what I was looking for and that's what I was needing to find the direction that I wanted to go in. Carol's a perfect example of someone who wanted to find a new career because of a life change. With a growing family and a son with special needs, she wanted to find a job that fit her new life. It was incredible to hear speak so highly about a program that helps people do just this. Using WorkBC resources, I was able to find people who helped Carol and so many others transition into the next phase of their lives. I met program manager Karina Budd of WCG, who was eager to tell me all about their work and even introduced me to some of the people who facilitate the training. We run several groups and 12 people at a time, so it is a group program and on average about 50 people a year. Good numbers. Yeah, it's a 10-week program, so four weeks are in the classroom and getting to know each other and team building in the class. And it's for 18 to 80-year-olds, so that we have a wide variety of age. Having an opportunity to take in some self-assessment training made me appreciate how personal discovery goes a long way in finding a career that's right for you. It was exciting to see the action in person. I know there's a huge success rate with the program. What do you think within it equates to that success for the, for the participants? What it does is it works with groups of clients to prepare them to find work. So we take all different types of participants, whoever they are, and we work with them to first uncover their goal and then to try to help them make connections within the local labour market. Life changes, that's a fact. But how will you adapt? How will you go about making the change and finding your fit? WorkBC.ca can help you explore careers, learn what jobs are in demand and where, and even help you find a job. It also directs you to WorkBC Employment Centers, where you'll find programs and resources to help you learn skills like resume and cover letter writing, job search strategies, and computer skills. Through WorkBC, Carol was able to learn about careers and opportunities in her region. Now, she's transitioned to do a new career as a spa manager. So what's life like now, after the program? It's awesome. I took the course and did the program, and I ended up with this job. I take my kids to school every morning. Um, I'm home every night. After dinner, I'm now able to do things with them. Like on Sundays, we go skiing. I have a, it's, it's a better quality of life for me. And to, to have that, that kind of a world and that kind of a life, it's incredible. Bye, Hello. Harry. Goodbye. Get your backpack, man. Get your backpack, man. Being in the spa, I still get to take care of people. I still get to spoil people. And that's very nurturing for me, and it's very fulfilling. Life has a funny way of making decisions for you, and never at your convenience. Carol's been able to meet those challenges head on, doing it all with a smile. She built a new life that works for her and her family.
Moving into a new career certainly isn't easy, but with the right tools, the right people, and a little rest and relaxation along the way, I started to see how it could all be possible. <laughs>